Hello, and welcome to the Source One Countdown to ISM 2017 podcast series. Consider us your on the go source for the latest insights in the procurement, supply management, and strategic sourcing industry as we get ready for the premier supply chain event of the year. Hello, my name is Jennifer Engel, and I'm a senior analyst at Source One Management Services. Today, I'm going to discuss what it takes to be a strategic sourcing consultant. There's an ongoing inside joke amongst my family and friends that despite my constant reminders, none of them are exactly sure what I do for a living. To my liberal arts friends, I work in business. To my business friends, I work in consulting. And even to my niche group of consulting peers, the exact role of a procurement professional is opaque at best. The role of a strategic sourcing consultant is one that requires a broad knowledge base of business functions and only a slightly tighter range of subject matter expertise. So what types of skills and expertise enable success in a strategic sourcing role? Well, first, one must become a jack of enterprise software platforms. You must have a fundamental understanding of an organization's procure-to-pay model, and it's critical to pinpoint areas of opportunity for streamlining workflows. Being able to identify and map the data flow from PO creation through invoice payment, GL coding, and key performance indicator reporting is necessary to properly assess the value of procurement and eliminate manual integrations which are hurting the bottom line. You also must have knowledge of dashboard creation and reporting. Tracking KPIs is all but useless if the metrics are not being communicated in a clear, concise, and accurate manner. Procurement professionals must understand the metrics that are most valuable to the organization and ensure that those metrics are available to the key executives driving the organizational strategy. A well-maintained dashboard delivers a valuable storyboard showing the successes and opportunities identified in the procurement space. Next, you must be able to adapt to different cultures. Adapting to a client's organizational culture is not a skill limited to strategic sourcing consulting, but what is unique to this particular role is that the adaptation must flow from supplier to client and back to foster meaningful strategic partnerships. A strategic sourcing consultant must be able to clearly and appropriately convey a message to suppliers from family-owned packaging operations to multinational technology companies. You also must be able to adapt to different categories. While most procurement professionals have one or more specific categories of expertise, those in the consulting space must be able to adapt the sourcing process to categories that may be less familiar. The ability to perform efficient and effective market research is vital in finding opportunity in more obscure or less frequently sourced categories. And lastly, you must have knowledge of interpretation of product specification and requirements. Similar to category adaptation is the ability to interpret product specifications and categories outside of your immediate realm of expertise. While stakeholders can be relied on for the more technical aspects, a sourcing analyst should be able to identify gap areas in the documentation that may become a roadblock during a competitive sourcing process. Essentially, the procurement professional needs to have, at the very least, a proficient understanding of all areas within an organization that interact with procurement. As the value of procurement becomes more apparent across organizations, these interactions are becoming more frequent and more intricate, leading to a competitive advantage for those ahead of the learning curve. To fully take ownership of the various functions of procurement, from identifying a need or opportunity to execution of a contract and the sourcing functions that fall between, a sourcing professional must also be a master of data analytics. A sourcing consultant must be able to validate across multiple sources and reconcile to form a complete picture of current purchasing habits. This relies heavily on the ability to manipulate and summarize data while maintaining its integrity even in categories with complex pricing structures or thousands of SKUs of data. You also must be a master of market intelligence and research. One of the most frequently used terms in business, procurement being no exception, is the word opportunity. Utilization of market intelligence and research is key in identifying areas of opportunity prior to investing resources into a full sourcing initiative. Efficient use of this skill set reduces the risk of wasted resources on a project that does not have feasibility and ultimately increases your procurement ROI. You also must be a master of negotiation. Possibly one of the more obvious required skills, the importance of negotiation tactics cannot be overstated. A procurement professional must be able to approach negotiation from the standpoint of adding value both to the client and the supplier and finding the ideal mix of leverage points to satisfy both parties and create the foundation for an ongoing strategic partnership. You have to be a master of contract development. While the legal terms are best left to the lawyers, the business terms are what drive the most value from the contracting process. Procurement professionals must be able to integrate knowledge of best practices and payment terms, additional pricing incentives, termination and auto renewal clauses, and language specific to the product or service in question to secure the relationship and maximize value. Lastly, a procurement professional must be a master of ongoing category expertise. While being a jack of all categories is an asset, a procurement professional should always strive towards achieving and maintaining subject matter expertise in a particular area. Many purchasing categories face frequent regulation changes, 
technological advances, commodity price fluctuations, and a multitude of other factors that require a dedicated subject matter expert to remain competitive as industry conditions change. While this list is certainly not exhaustive, it does begin to offer some insight as to what types of skills and expertise are needed to support procurement functions on a daily basis. Certainly as procurement moves to the forefront of a business value driver, this list will only become more robust and the need for experienced procurement professionals will grow. Thanks for tuning in to the Source One podcast. Remember to visit us online at www.sourceoneinc.com. For more insights from our strategic sourcing and procurement experts, check out our blog at www.strategicsorcerer.com. Want to provide us feedback? Have an idea for another podcast? Let us know by emailing us at prrequest at sourceoneinc.com. Thanks for listening.